This is our setup on the three horsepower router. We have half of a 700 tail case bolted to this variable speed router mount and we adjust the speed accordingly to get the RPM we're at which is in this case around 9000 and this is showing the Chinese weights this happens to be the 700 size Chinese weights they're basically very similar except for the thickness of the head of the nut and the bolt hex is the same size on both it's a 6 millimeter hex on the nut 5 millimeter hex on the bolt so that you don't need two of the same size nut drivers. A quick UK tail for 600 slash 700 T-Rex with 92 millimeter KB Dream Design blades and running at uh, roughly 9000 RPM approximately the tail speed of the 600 700 general range. Um, this is a test with the stock blade bolts so this is our baseline tennis racket force we'll be looking at now. Here we go. She had 26 uh, ounces of force in the one direction and around 30 some in the other. Uh, so we'll see where we get to with Chinese weights. A quick UK tail for the 600 slash 700 T-Rex with 92 millimeter KB Dream Design blades. So we're actually testing this as a 600. And this is the run with just the Chinese nut and bolt now replaced instead of the stock blade bolt. We now have the Chinese uh, weight nut and bolt installed so we'll see what the forces are now you can see we cut the forces in half there still leaving enough pushrod force on there so that we uh, have a consistent force on the pushrod on either side of zero. Uh, that's what we're looking for. Quick UK tail for the 600 slash 700 with KB Dream Design 102 millimeter blades for 700 size helis. So we're testing this as a 700, uh, roughly 9000 RPM tail speed. Testing with the stock blade bolts for our baseline tennis racket effect forces. So here we go. So we had there about 27 one direction, 32 the other. So now we will uh, put some Chinese bolts in there and see what we get. Same setup, quick UK tail set up as a 700 with 102 millimeter KB Dream Design blades and uh, this time with Chinese weights tuned for these blades and grips and running the same RPM, roughly 9000. There we go. there a significant reduction a little more than half um, still leaving some pushrod force there to keep backlash out of the system that's what we're shooting for <laughs> 